Hi everyone, it's been a while since I've made a video to put up on YouTube and I found this application this morning and I thought it was really neat and I wanted to make a video for it so that I can show you guys um, what I'm doing with it. Um, anybody that knows me or have, has watched my videos knows that I keep a stack of sticky notes on my computer screen, on my desktop. I, I think of my screen as my virtual desk and I keep my utilities over here on the right and one of my one of the main things that I use throughout the day as I'm working are my sticky notes. Now I used to use the Windows uh, stickies that, that comes um, with the operating system Windows 7 and um, and I've used them for a really long time but you've got six or seven colors and that's it and I keep all of my things color-coded and so what I really like about this application although cram-packed with features this is one of the main things that I really love about it is that I can customize the colors so if you've got the RGB color that you want to set to a sticky note you can set it up to be absolutely any color of the rainbow. So I have blue for supplies, green for to-dos, pink for messages, work order changes is purple, and, and that those are the colors that are consistent with when I use the Windows 7 sticky notes. Um, I've changed the notes one to a really nice taupe color. Uh, I used to use gray, so oh and then I had the yellow for contacts and I've added two more colors and that's red for deadlines and then I I did an orange for miscellaneous so I keep this stack on my desk for reference and when I want to open up a sticky note very quickly I click on the Windows key and S and it adds uh, another sticky so um, I'll just start typing on the sticky note if I want to fill out a phone number or something like that. Also, I have set the application to open up a new sticky with the date and time because most of the times I want to timestamp what I'm doing, but you can also right click on this and set a title to it. So you could keep the time but add something else to it. And I'm not going to do anything with that right now. And then you can also, I've set up styles to my stickies. So if it, if it was something that I needed to do, I would set it to green. And something else that's really neat is that you can roll up your stickies and you can roll them back down. And so basically what you could do with your stickies is you could have a whole bunch of them on your desktop and just keep the whole stack of them here on the right and come come over when you wanted to look at something. Of course, you know, you've got the title here for each of them. And then you just click unroll. So, um, oh yeah. And then there's one other really neat thing that I like about this application is that you can set an alarm to a sticky. So I'm going to set this alarm to this sticky for one minute so that you'll see what happens when it goes off. I have set in the preferences of this application, I've set it to make a sound, jiggle or wiggle, and it also, the border around the sticky note flashes different colors. So that's how it, it, it shows me that there's something that I've set a reminder to. Uh, I, I do reminders on my calendars for appointments and webinars and, and things that I need to remember. I do that on my calendar, but this is handy for things that you want to set up on the fly. Like if I'm in the middle of a project and I've got something in the oven and I want to remember that it has to come out in 30 minutes, I'll do a quick sticky note and set an alarm for 30 minutes. That way as I'm working, I don't forget that I have something in the oven. Um, it, oh, and then there's times where I've needed to call a business or something that's on the Pacific Coast and Oh, there's my alarm reminding me to show you how to do this alarm. So you see how it's jiggling. We heard the noise and the border of it is also flashing. And to have it stop, I just click on it. 
So like I was saying before, if, if I need to make a phone call and because of the time change and I'm calling somebody all the way on the Pacific Coast and they're not quite open yet, but they're going to open in 10 or 20 minutes, I'll set a reminder that in 20 minutes that they're open so that I can remember to call them because I have relied on things like sticky notes and, and writing things on my iPad and putting things into my phone. I've relied on things like that for so long that I don't keep stuff in my head. They don't stay in there and, and I forget things very quickly. And I'm always working on 10 things at a time anyway. So this really helps me to keep on track. Uh, like I said, this application has tons of features in it. and and it comes with a really um, well-defined um, uh, instruction manual and it's of showing you all the things that you can do. Uh, you can, if you're on the same network as somebody else that, that has stickies installed on their computer, you can send stickies back and forth to one another like instant messaging. Um, there are tons of things, tons of things that you can do with these. You can email them. Um, you can also synchronize your stickies with other computers, and that's a little tricky. I'm not going to go into that now, but um, you basically go to where the, the file is sitting on your computer and have it syncing with the same file on your other computer, and that way they match. I have found that I have to close it on one machine before I go to the other machine and open it. Otherwise, it messes up my stickies. I hope that you enjoyed this quick video and me showing you these sticky notes. I love sticky notes. Um, I used to love the the hybrid sticky notes that you buy at the office supply store and I kept them all over and, and wrote on them and stuck them, but anybody that knows me knows that I'm completely paperless. I don't do anything with paper. I have broke all my pencils. I don't do paper at all. So this I still get to enjoy my sticky notes and my colors and stay color coded, but it's it's virtual on my virtual desk. I hope that you're going to try it. Um, this is the this is the website that that you can download, and um, I think I mentioned that it's free. It's for PC. There's one that's very similar to this this sticky note application for Mac, and it's called Sketch. And it basically has all the same features, and it looks kind of the same as well. So if you have a Mac, ch uh, check out Sketch, uh, because this is, this is for PC. There isn't a Mac version. And like I said, this is the website where you can download the application, and it's free. I hope you'll try it. Bye.